welcome back to my channel. So I'm here with a little bit of a different video. I don't know if anybody's actually going to want to see this or not. Who knows, we're going to post it anyway. So I am a Scentsy consultant, independent Scentsy consultant. And I just did a video for my Facebook group, which has the new products from the catalogue that I just received. Not all of them, but the newer ones that I just ordered. And I just did a little unboxing for posting on my Facebook group. And I thought I would post it here too. Cat. Um, just to show you guys some of the new stuff that I'm enjoying, I am going to be doing a favourites video every month and it will include Scentsy because most of my Scentsy is my favourite every month. But I'm going to do planner favourites, Scentsy favourites and regular everyday favourites. And I wanted to do the first video showing you some of the new stuff I got so that you can see what I'm talking about. If anybody hasn't heard of Scentsy, I'll leave the link down below for my website. Um, which you can get to my Scentsy website. If anybody has any questions, you can ask them down below. If you'd like to become a consultant, join my team, let me know. Um, but all giggles aside, I just thought it'd be quite nice to show you some of the cool stuff that I got. Like, like this. Yeah, so if anyone has any questions, please let me know. I'm gonna go because the cat is meowing at me. Okay, I have some new products to show you and I thought I would do a video rather than just taking pictures of them. So I got my order from the brand new catalog. All my tabs for what I wanna buy. I ordered some new car bars. So these are the current car bars that we do. Right here, I don't know if it's focusing. And they hang from anywhere in your car, which is great except my husband hits his head on them. So these are the new ones. These are car bars with clips. So this little clip here slots into your vent and then the car bar sticks onto the back of it. So I ordered these in Luna, because that's my favorite smell. Um, and I will probably try and put up some pictures of it in my car. I'm gonna go and put it in my car today. And they come in at 11 pounds for a pack of two, which the normal car bars are 7.25 each. So I think this is a really good deal because you're getting two of them. Next up is Scentsy Pets. One of my items was out of stock, so it is gonna be shipped later. But first, I got the Best Buds Pet Shampoo. This giant bottle is £18.25, and I got this in the oatmeal and aloe scent, which is really nice. Really lovely, cannot wait to give my dogs a bath in that. Then I also got this, which is No Not Spot. This is £12 for this bottle, it's 237 mils, and it apparently, matte busting spray removes tangles and conditions the skin. I got this in orange zest and nectar, and I am waiting for my Freshen Up Pup Dog Deodorizing Spray. I'll show you that when it comes in. Next is this. This is the wall fan diffuser. I got it in the star print. So we do a an item called the Scentsy Go, um, which is, you don't need a plug. It charge, excuse the cat. It charges up um, using a USB port and you put in these scent pods. This is the new version of that. So it's like the equivalent of that, except you do need a plug for this one because it is a wall fan. It's plastic. The top pops off. Let me get my pods. And you just drop the pod in, put the top back on, plug it in, and press the little button. It doesn't light up, just the button, like the bit around the button lights up. I really like the pattern on this one. This is the star pattern. And you'll have to excuse all the mess behind me, by the way. This is just real life. So I got this. I want to use it in possibly my room or I was thinking the hallway because that way if a dog runs past in the hallway and knocks my warmer off, wax gets on the wall, which is fine. You can take it off with a hairdryer, but I don't want to be doing that. This way, I don't need to do that. Okay, I'm gonna open this one next. This is from the Autumn Catalog. This is the Sugar Skull Mini Warmer. At the time I ordered this, the bundle with wax was only available on the plugs. So 
So I ordered it with a plug. Oh man, that's so cute. So it doesn't light up. There are holes in the back which the light will come out. The bulb comes with the warmer base, but I'm not gonna use this. I'm going to use this new product, which I also ordered. So the skull, the skull warmer is 36 pounds with a tabletop base and 24 pounds with a wall plug. And it's in the autumn catalog, so it's limited. But I bought this, which is another new item they're bringing out this, this catalog. They already have these in America. And I'm so glad they brought them out here. So this is the tabletop base. You can buy these separately. So you don't need to buy it with a warmer and it's 22 pounds. So if you have mini warmers at home and you don't have that many places you can plug them in, you could buy one of these. It just looks like this. And your warmer just clicks into place. Like so. So it's essentially turning all those mini warmers that you have into a tabletop warmer with the plug attached. I mean, that looks pretty good. I also got the glass based version because I have some glass mini warmers that I'm gonna use that with. So next up is another new warmer. We do um, a warmer called the Etched Core and it's white. I have it in white. It's an element warmer. Um, it is being changed now to a bulb warmer. Most of the warmers will be bulb warmers from now on. Um, they prevent the plate getting too hot, like the bit at the top underneath the actual element can get quite hot. It's not too hot to touch, but it can get quite hot. And the bulb warmers just have a better warming effect on the wax. So the etched core is white and you get wraps for it and things like that. But they have released this version, which is the rose gold etched warmer. Which is gorgeous. So I have a Christmas wrap, it's white, it says peace and it has a Christmas tree. I think that would look good on this, especially as the dish itself is white. Um, it's a wall plug, plugs are now attached. It's gorgeous. And all these tiny little holes, the light will come through. It does come with its bulb. It's really pretty. This one comes in at 48 pounds, which I think is really reasonable for this one. It's a beautiful color really beautiful last but by no means least is this new product this is the fragrance flower now scentsy is all about trying to find new ways to introduce scent into your room or your house where you don't require a plug we all love the waxes we do but sometimes you just don't have a space with a plug for example my front hall does not have a plug and i currently use a scentsy go in there but i have to turn it on I have to remember to turn it on and it doesn't provide my consistent smell because it goes off after three hours which is one of the things I like about it in my bathroom but my front hall I would quite like something that had a more consistent scent so this is the Scentsy flower Comes so it has this jar which is full of the oil and then it comes with this rose. And what you do is you take the lid off, you put the rose in, and the rose gradually soaks up the oil and absorbs the oil and releases the fragrance. I got it in Luna. I'll admit I don't like this tape sticker. I have seen people take that off, so I'm gonna try and take it off and I will post some pictures of it without the sticker. But I can put this in my front hall. It will provide, I do know this one, 60 days of scent. These come in at £19.50 each. For me, I think that's worth it for the 60 days. I am interested to see if it lasts longer than 60 days because these things often do. Um, I think that it's a conservative date they give you because they can't guarantee it longer than that. So I'm interested to see exactly how long this does last. Um, you can't buy refills, you just buy a brand new one with a new flower and a new bottle. But really, for £19.50 for 60 days, that's really not bad. Other 
um, oil release things I've seen, like the reed diffusers, they don't last that long and I actually don't like the long reeds. I think they take up too much space. I find them a little bit intrusive and they seem to just be more vulnerable to being knocked over, whereas this is quite little. It's not likely to be knocked over. So this is the new flower. This is the fragrance flower. It comes in aloe water and cucumber, Amazon rain, Luna and sea salt and avocado. So Luna, sea salt and avocado are two of my favorite scents. So these will be perfect. And that's it. That's what I got for my order of new, well, that's not all I got. Can you see over just there? Yeah, that's a whole bunch of new scents. But there's no point in me showing you those because they look, you can't tell anything without smelling them but I got all the new scents as well so we have 19 new fragrances some of them are ones that are brought back for example Eskimo Kiss has come back which is good because that's my favorite um but yeah so that's all the new products thank you for watching guys bye